Hello, everyone. This Monday, May 25th, we commemorate Memorial Day across all of the United States. It's a day set aside to remember our fallen soldiers, our nation's greatest heroes. This year, Memorial Day will be marked in a different way. Due to the COVID-19 pandemic, we won't have the parades and the large gatherings we're used to, but we will honor these heroes in our hearts through virtual celebrations and in small gatherings of no more than 10 people. Our beaches will be closed, but people can go to our parks, shops, and restaurants, as long as everyone continues to wear masks, practice social distancing, and follow all of Miami-Dade's new normal guidelines. If it weren't for the many sacrifices made by the brave men and women who defended our freedoms, we wouldn't be here today. So I salute all of our nation's heroes on behalf of the 2.8 million residents of Miami-Dade County. Memorial Day serves as a sobering yet necessary reminder to all of us that living in freedom comes at a steep and often very personal human cost. That's a message I think resonates especially strongly in this community, where so many of our residents have sacrificed so much to be in a place that allows us all to live and express ourselves freely. When we're giving gratitude to our fallen soldiers on Memorial Day, let's also thank the families of those fallen soldiers who sacrificed their loved ones so that we may all enjoy the quality of life we now have. Let's also thank all the military veterans in Miami-Dade County and across our nation. Each of them is a living reminder of all that's good and right in this nation. So thank you very much for your service to our amazing country. As we continue to move forward together as a community, let's not forget those who have made this the land of the free and the home of the brave. May God bless you all, and may God continue to bless Miami-Dade County and our great United States of America.